Hello and welcome to VR Wednesdays. Each week we try out some sort of game or demo or something on the Oculus Rift. Now this week I was messing around with Star Citizen. You can see in the background I'm messing around there. That's not me speaking currently. I'm speaking as an overlay, as a, as a voiceover. But that's because all the audio for this bit kind of got corrupted. And a tiny bit of the audio in the actual gameplay we're going to see got corrupted. So apologies for that. But I'm just basically talking about how awesome Star Citizen is. How... This isn't a particularly amazing um, viewing for the Oculus because it's not native, but it does work and it gives you quite a lot of immersion. It doesn't draw a geometrically 3D, so it's not true 3D. It is like a really immersive monitor in your eyes, but it is pretty cool. It is pretty fun, although it's a little bit sick inducing. Um, I get rid of the video of my uh, the camera of myself in a minute as well because it was just lagging the hell out of the Oculus. Star Citizen is not built to work with the Oculus at the moment, but you can bodge it to work using Vorpix, and it's an enjoyable experience. Anyway, enough of me talking randomly. I'll allow you to watch some gameplay of me playing, and it'll be good. Right. Awesome. Okay, well, this looks absolutely great on my face. Um, it's uh, a little bit laggy, but that might just be because it's the beginning. Oh, I found a swarm, it's always a little laggy. Um, yeah, it looks great. What's the fucking 3D? Oh, that's weird. Stand by, scanning. Oh, that's fucking weird. Uh, oh, yeah, so Stand that's by. confused my brain, um, looking in third person mode. Um, hopefully, we can kill some stuff. Um, I'm in the Aurora LN, so I can blame that if I, uh, if I get totally owned by my teammates. Um, I'm pretty excited. It might not work at all. Um, I suppose if it's gone online as a video, it probably did work all right at least. I cannot wait for native support to be fully done for Star Citizen. It's going to be absolutely great. It might not make you a better gamer. Well, it probably won't make you a better gamer. Um, or better at the game at least. But it's going to be immersive. And that's what I want. And this is what this is currently. Using Vorpix to emulate this, it's looking very immersive. I don't, oh, it makes me feel sick when it lags, and there's going to be a lot of lag at the beginning of each wave. Um, fortunately, I know where the L key is now. So, what I'm doing here is I'm using um, Focus Target um, to help block on. Um, it's the only way I'm going to be able to keep up with guys on my team. Oh, that's weird. Um, so I'm not really moving my head at all, um, because, and this is annoying, uh, it makes me immediately feel like I'm going to vomit. Warning, there are multiple hostiles inbound. Stand by, scanning. It does feel pretty awesome though, it's just, it needs native mode. Um, it's worth, if you've got an Oculus, worth trying it out on Vireo or Vorpix. I'll put some of the settings in down below, because um, it does look pretty sexual. Uh, and I am able to aim, which is a big plus, but I do have to press L. Um, I'm gonna I'm trying to I'm gonna see what happens to my crash. Come on. I, I'm absolutely blind. I think I'm out of power. Shit, son. I oh man. So oh, oh. I've never. <laughs> it's like I'm wearing a neck brace. I'm really sorry if you wanted to see like interiors of the cockpit. I'll look around in a second. Oh oh. 
Uh, this is actually quite bad for motion sickness and I don't really get motion sick. Uh, I appear to be top of the scoreboard, um, which is rare in most situations anyway. <laughs> but everything looks pretty, pretty sexual to be honest. Stand by, scanning. Oh man. Okay, so <laughs> there's a fight going on around me. Scanning. I'm. Oh, this this is actually quite vomit inducing. Um, and moving my head more than just a little bit is really, really. Well, I can't really look at my groin. I can't look any. That's weird. That I can't look any further down than that. Um, my head's kind of locked around, but you can see. I can see space. Stand by, scanning. Oh man. Okay, so this actually looks pretty good. Um, and feels pretty nice. The FOV's a little bit too restrictive. Um, it really, really motion sick. It's making me at the moment. Um, oh. But, but uh, anyway. Oh dear. Oh. Oh no 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 no! Oh no! Don't crash! Don't crash! It's quite hard to fly with an Oculus on. I must admit, it looks very pretty. Um, it works surprisingly well. It's very immersive. Um, it's very very immersive. But I find myself not wanting to move my head at all. Scanning. Radar contact. Radar contact. Right, so I mean, it looks really good. It feels really good. It's very immersive. It's making me pretty hot and sweaty, unfortunately. Um, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come on. Can't lock using myself properly because it <laughs> uses the ball pick settings to uh, move my eyes around. Oh, so it goes into edge peak mode. Oh, Blech. Come here. Come here. Oh, they're so much faster than me. But I do have quite long range weapons. Oh, that's weird. Zooming in. That's going to give me an epileptic fit. Oh, the flickering of that laser, that's not nice. Oh, man. Uh, it's a bit weird as well with my, because of the way the cockpit, like, reflections on. I need to turn the reflections off, actually. That's what I got to do with the Oculus. Um, it's kind of blinding me. That guy Arcturus, I wonder if he's my mate. <laughs> Next one. The play Star Citizen with that name. Mm. Or similar name in comparison. Uh, right. So yeah, this looks great. Uh, the, the lighting effects are far too blinding. Uh, I need a way of turning bloom. I can, actually can turn it off. And use, get a user file and actually turn it off. So I need to turn the bloom off. Um, I need a way of when I look around my cockpit, not making me vomit. Oh, I'm gonna actually lock my head. Oh. So I'm actually having to lock my head occasionally, um, which obviously isn't the best for immersion. So you want to be able to look around your cockpit. You want to be able to enjoy what's going on. Come here, you little brand new tricks. Come on, come on. I 
I'm running off mu muscle memory and adrenaline mostly. Um, it's actually quite hard to see what's going on. Um, but I got so used to using... No! I'm out of power! Come here. No, 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 no. Not like this. is that when it lags like that, um, it makes you basically want to vomit. Oh. Really weird. Oh, I needed to put, uh, I needed to beg the power plant to the Aurora LN. Um, that's the only major problem I have with that. I quite like the ship. Uh, I don't mind that she's slow. She's relatively tanky what she is, and she's very upgradable. Um, and she can beat a lot of better ships because she's a very, very good ship. She just needs a better power plant. And also, for some reason, with the Oculus on, it seems to be, Vorpix seems to be making the planet's surface go a bit weird. I don't know if, I assume you guys can see, obviously you can see that. It's, it's like it detextures the planet. Oh. I can't believe I haven't crashed yet. That's, uh, that's impressive for me in general. Um, Stand by, scanning. Oh. Radar contact. What's going on? Oh, that's that lag is annoying. Oh, beginning of the uh, I'm not sure how long I'm gonna do a play. By. It's I mean it's awesome. The regular frame rate and the lag. Stand by. Making it weird. Let's get real close to one of these vandal. Say real close. I mean I might not any get anywhere near them before they get killed. It's not even the slowest ship ever. Oh man. I wonder how slow the actual big ship is gonna be. The Oculus on like in a turret of like a constellation or something. It's piloting at the moment, you're gonna get motion sickness. When it's native, it's gonna be a lot better, but I can imagine it's gonna actually give people motion sickness again. I mean some of the mo mo moves are so irregular. Come on. We can hit him. We just need one nice hit. Come on. Oh, come on, that was mine! Oh! Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, God damn you, lack of power! No, no, no! Yes! Oh, awesome. Have some of that, have some of that. Oh god. Oh! See, so that's weird. When it gets close to me, I kind of panic. I forget to shoot. I just want to protect my face. Um, oh, I can't see anything. Redding out is really horrible as well. Yes! Come straight towards me. Oh, 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 oh. Damn it. That lag. And I know it's because stuff's either spawning in. Um, all the rounds starting, but all the stuff's exploding, so that's almost unbearable. No, I'm continuing because it is pretty fun, and it is immersive. Shit. I can't, I can't use missiles either, I can use really missiles. Um, so next time I do this, uh, I will uh, get a bit, better, bit of, uh, better config. Um, Possibly get rid of the blue. I need to get rid of the bloom as well. Because when looking at that, that blue dwarf in the background is sick as well. So many vomit inducing things going on here. Come on. Don't be like that. I, I've lost where the arrow is. Because there isn't so much on the screen. Come on. Oh, this is amazing. Uncomfortable. Sort of stuff. Oh, oh, oh. now my ship's gone a bit wonky. Stand by. Let's have a look at it. Oh, that was a mistake to actually have a look at it like that. Oh, they've knocked the paint off my ship. Oh, that is weird. But, oh, yeah, it stutters a bit as well. I mean, it is pretty awesome, and 
if you've got an Oculus and you've got a copy of uh, Vorpix or Vireo or something like that and you've got Star Citizen, it's worth giving it a go um, just because it's cool and it's immersive and it's quite fun. Um, you tell me about your motion sickness. I mean, this is making me really motion sick, especially because my ship is... Oh, it's not going where I want it to go. No! Oh, no, 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 no. Um, that asteroid literally, or space mountain as I call them, crept up on me there. Oh, let's uh, try and take, take out this wave and then we'll call it a day because otherwise I'm going to be sick. It is really enjoyable. Um, it's probably one for running around the hangar in more than um, actually flying. Uh, oh, shh. Is... Come on. Come here. Oh, out of power. Hostile destroyed. Oh. Ah. My head seems to have disconnected from my body. Oh. Right. No, 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 no. Do not black out. Oh, that's an odd sensation. Oh. No, 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 come on. Don't be like that. It's, it's a lot harder to aim. Oh, oh I'm gonna be sick. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna be sick. Oh. Right, I don't care. Oh. Yeah, so zooming in is weird as well. I don't know the, the, what it looks like for, for you guys. Oh, this is really quite fun. <laughs> Where'd he go? Zero hostile contacts remaining. Oh. oh dear. Stand by. Oh. Radar um, contact. Where are we looking? Radar contact. Where are we looking? I'm using loads of different Radar shortcuts contact. all the time to manage my voice. Um, oh, space sickness. I don't. Uh, <laughs> the flicker on that laser thing is horrible. Um, ugh. right, come on, come in, come in, come here, you little brick. I can't hit anything anymore. So after like 15 minutes, all of my aiming ability, such as it was, has now gone. And it's just a little bit too confusing for my brain now. Oh, got him. Um, so my ship's pretty battered and that doesn't help. I'm not sure I'm supposed to be aiming anymore. Stand by. Yeah. moon. Oh God. Don't move, don't move my head. Don't move that. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh, uh. Come here, come here, come on. I'm sure this should be hitting him. Oh, I got him. <laughs> oh, one second, one second. Let me just. Oh. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> Come towards me. That's a much better way of, getting, of killing them. Uh, I don't know where the next one is. I can't see the arrow on my screen. Ah. Oh! That was not comfortable. Getting rammed is not very nice. Oh, dear. 
That's weird. You. Uh, seconds. So we can find X. Ah, cool. Oh. Welcome to Robert Space Industries. Enjoy there we go. Your life. It's in a gimbaled mode, which means it's unflyable, basically. Right. Oh. Mm. Wait. Come here. I can't really make. This is really weird. It's, all, it's a little bit blurry for me now. Um, come here. I'm so unable to hit anything anymore. That's um, 15 minutes, and then the ability to aim is uh, it's pretty gone. Oh dear. Come here. <laughs> he just crashed. Did he just crash. Good job. Good job. So have a look around. So this is going to be a very beautiful game. Um, this is going to be amazing when it has native office support. I can't look at that. The blueness of the... Oh my god. Too much bloom on everything. Oh. Right. What can we do here? Oh shit. Probably not a good thing. I'm going to zoom in. Can we get a kill from zooming in. You know where the chaff and flare is? I think I can activate a chaff and flares. Anyway. Oh god. Oh no. I'd like to get track IR setups um, as well without the optics. I think that would give a lot better. No, 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 no. Yeah, I am activating. I can hear the, the chaff's changing. Chaff and flare. Uh, I can't see anything. Knocked out my own sensors with the chaff. Oh, oh, that was weird. I think I just got sniped out. Oh, head move. Stand by for reintegration. Welcome to Robert Space Industries. Join the wide system check. Oh dear. Stand by. Oh, we got this. We got this. Fire the missiles! Fire the missiles! I've had to do something weird with my eyes! What am I doing? I can't see anything. So the Vorpix button is the same as my... Oh, I that. The Vorpix um, edge look button is the same as my missile button. Um, which is, as you can imagine, not ideal. Um, so I was just panicking there a lot. Well, this is almost over because I'm not going to survive after this wave, really. Um, we can... Kill this guy. Kill this by the Probably he killed after us. Yes! Let's uh, finish this way. Come on. Oh. Then we can bail out. Let's see what that's like. I can't see a thing! Frick! I couldn't see anything. Oh, where's the other... Oh, well, there he is. Oh, that's weird. What's going on? I can't... I, I, I don't know what I'm doing. Right, let's bail out. But can I not bail out in this? No! Right. It's, it's time to go out. 
Oh, I feel absolutely sick of my stomach. It is really immersive, it is really fun. It's because my brain kind of almost thinks it's 3D, but it's not at all compared to uh, stuff that's geometry drawn. It's really immersive. Oh, wait, let me take off the stuff. Um, it's really immersive, it's really, really good. Let's, uh, let's set that on. It, uh, I, I could just vomit all the time, man. Oh, let's watch this guy for a second. Oh! But, yeah, it's well worth doing. Um, Training. I was just using more because uh, I've got other videos on the uh, setup guides um, already. And it's pretty much just the same, it's just that Star Citizen now works a lot better um, in 1.1. Oh. 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 A little tiny recording window open, and oh, that's oh, no, the screen for me. This guy's doing alright. looks to um, people that aren't wearing an Oculus now and it's it's similar to that but a thousand times more confusing. Oh. Yeah, it's very confusing around that Oculus. Very beautiful though um, and yeah it's, it's good. It needs to be, it needs native support though and it's worth giving a go but native support. I guess it has to be good enough. Oh, it needs to be well I think. Someone hasn't Use the Oculus properly on, on that before, maybe? I don't know. It's certainly not perfect, but it is quite fun. And when native support's there, it's going to be great. If you've got an Oculus, then it's definitely worth checking out using Virio or Vorpix to get it working with Star Citizen.